Good day, Team GCI. I'm Brad Alexander, and in today's GCI Market Outlook, let's take a look at Forex trading on the S&P 500, pound yen, WTI crude oil, gold, and silver. With the strong U.S. dollar, price action on silver is falling with all kinds of bearish technical signals. Before we look at that, don't forget to like, subscribe, and get notified on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. If we look at price action on silver for the last three weeks, we can see the reversal as price crashed through the support of this neckline on this double top. The red candle represents the aftermath of the U.S. elections. Now we are in a downward channel with price action just bouncing off the upper trend line and the stochastic oscillator turning back down. We see similar price action on gold, but if we move out to the daily chart, we see price action is near support and the stochastic oscillator is very oversold. Last time we were wondering if price action on WTI would fall to $66, but support now seems to be at 67.50 with a descending triangle formed. MACD is still bearish, but the stochastic oscillator looks like it may turn up from oversold. JPY has found some sudden strength today, and the biggest response was with pound yen, with the pound just above 196 yen. Yesterday, Jerome Powell and the U.S. Federal Reserve stated that with the booming U.S. economy, there is no rush to cut interest rates again. This caused indices like the S&P 500 to fall. If we look at the daily chart, we can see that there is more room to fall, but we will see if investors are willing to buy the dip. That's all for now. CFDs and FX are leveraged products, and your capital may be at risk.